Welcome to Monomoy in the Morning. Today is January 28th and it's the third day of midterms. Please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please be seated for a moment of silence. The Junior Class and Spirit Committee will be hosting a Valentine's Day dance on January, no, correction, on February 6th, Saturday, from 7 p.m. to 10 p.m. in the gym. The cost will be $5 and it is a semi-formal dance. Gentlemen should wear a shirt and tie and ladies should dress up. DJ Drew Sanator is whipping up the music. Starting Monday, February 8th, the Class of 2018 meetings will be held every Monday in Miss Mimi's classroom. Please come and be part of the class planning. There will be no meeting of the Interact Club this week due to midterms. We will meet again next week, February, Friday the 5th. Yearbooks can now be purchased online through February 5th. The cost is $85. The mock trial team will meet on Tuesday and Thursday this week at 235 in room 236. The Archery Club will be offering an eight-week class to become a certified archery instructor. You must be 15 years old or older, older to sign up. This certification will be useful to anyone who wants to deepen their knowledge of archery or who would like to teach archery at a camp. Classes will begin after February vacation. Please see Mr. Gifford in the guidance room for more information. Now to Mr. Burkhead with an important announcement. Good morning. I wanted to make a brief announcement regarding our recent visit from the Barnstable County Sheriff's Canine Drug Sniffing Dogs. The reasons and process so that our students and staff are in the loop. My primary, primary objective as principal is to keep everyone in the school safe. We all agree that drug use damages lives and has no place in our school. The K-9 visit is a proactive measure to send a message to students, staff, families, and communities that we take this very seriously and will do whatever it takes to ensure drugs are not in our school. To ensure a safe and efficient search, we instituted a stay in place protocol which, if you remember from our student and staff trainings at the beginning of the year, is typically a non-emergency situation when we need students and staff to stay in their rooms. Teaching and learning are expected to continue. I am proud to report that we searched the entire building, all lockers, locker rooms, and several classrooms, and did not find any drugs. We will continue to have periodic canine visits in our school and parking lots and expect the same results. I will close with stating that this is only one small part of what we are doing to proactively, in partnership with our community and parents, to support our students in sending clear messages that drugs are not allowed in our school or school premises, and educationally, how to avoid drug use and attain support if needed. Thank you and have a great day. Now for the last Monomoy Athletics Report. Boys Varsity got their first one of the season Tuesday by defeating Hull 46-44 in a close game down the stretch. They'll try to continue their winning streak tonight at 6.30 in a key matchup against the rival Nasa Warriors. Have a fantastic day, Monomoy.